Hey everyone, Brickhouse here with another video. Um, this one actually popped up as a news story while I was on vacation. And uh, this is how you have to treat those that are pushing an ideology. And in this case, an ideology um, of you could identify with however you want to be as as far as gender. <clears throat> Indiana Republican Ryan Webb mocks left by coming out as a lesbian woman of color. Republican Ryan Webb may look like a typical straight white male, but he wants voters of Delaware County, Indiana to know that he identifies as a lesbian woman of color. The city, the county councilman ruffled some feathers after announcing last month on Facebook that he has decided to come out and finally feel comfortable announcing my true authentic self, even though he hasn't changed his appearance or conservative views in any way. It is with great relief that I announced to everyone that I identify as a woman and not just any woman, but as a woman of color as well, he said in the April 12th post. I guess that would make me gay lesbian as well, since I am attracted to women. Indeed, Mr. Webb said he is happily married to his wife, Brandy Webb, with whom he has six children. I am continuing to retain my preferred pronouns of he, him. I am married to my beautiful wife, Brandy, Mr. Webb said Monday on Fox News Channel's Jesse Waters Primetime. She's running for the Muncie City Council in tomorrow's election. He added that that makes me a lesbian because I'm completely in love with her, even though I identify as a woman. We have six children together, so I think... That more than qualifies. Not everyone accepted his gender transition at an April 5th county council meeting. He was accused during public comment of mocking the transgender community. Some called on him to step down. See, that this is... I, I'll probably get in trouble for saying this, but this is how you deal with these people. You mock the hell out of them. It's one thing to say, hey, yeah, I'm transgender, I'm a woman, um, you do you. Or if it's a woman, hey, I'm transgender, I'm a man, you do you. But when it comes to pushing and trying to normalize that type of lifestyle on everyone, that is where the line is drawn, and that is where you just have to mock the hell out of them. His detractors on social media have questioned his sincerity of his gender conversion, calling him childish, disgraceful, and an ignorant bigot. Ah, uh, yeah, the same stuff that comes out every time. Indeed, indeed Mr. Webb posted before and after photos of himself on April 18th looking exactly the same. If he were serious, I'd sing his praises, said transgender activist Charlize Jameson at, at the council meeting. But instead, I know better. We all do. I know better because of his history of making hateful anti-trans statements on social media and disrespecting one's pronouns. I got news for ya. Pronouns suck. He has purposely and intentionally misgendered me and ridic ridiculing my own gender. Um, Charlize, are you a woman? Because if you are a woman, and he called you a woman, or said she, or her, he didn't misgender you. If you're a man, Charlie's, and he said, hello, sir, or mister, or he, or him, he didn't misgender you. Mr. Webb acknowledged that some people have really been upset. They've been mad about it. We had a group of individuals show up at a local Delaware County Council meeting to express their fake outrage and let me know that they thought I should resign, he said. But the support I've been getting across the country has been overwhelming. Mr. Webb said he has received a lot of good positive feedback from supporters across the nation and Europe. Some well-wishers have urged him to seek higher office. That would be awesome if he did. His backers include Daily Wire podcaster Matt Walsh, who said in a Sunday tweet, Wow, incredibly stunning and brave. 
Ryan Webb is a powerful black woman who deserves our full support and respect. Technically, Mr. Webb said he identifies as a Native American woman of color. Native, yeah, Native American woman of color, adding that he is very proud of his Cherokee heritage on both sides of his family. In his Facebook post, he said that I'm excited to bring some diversity to this county council. Until today, we didn't have any females of color or LGBTQIAPC++ on the council. I'm glad that we do now. Mr. Waters called him a trailblazer, and we respect that. So, yeah. Um, I'd love to hear your comments and your opinions about this county councilman in Indiana, Mr. Ryan Webb. Um, you may agree with me. You may disagree with me. The whole point of this is to have a conversation, and I want to hear everybody's opinions. So comment down below. Um, hit that like button. Hit that thumbs up, subscribe, share, leave a comment, hit the notification bell to get notified when my content's uploaded. And um, I thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in. And we will see you on the next video.